When you edit a message on Discord and you change it, you will see this edited tag. But what if I told you there was a way to edit this message without the edited tag showing up? And just so we're clear, this glitch could cause a pretty big problem on Discord, if not for one thing. But first, how did I do this in the first place? Well, we need to be in our browser because we are using the browser console to do all this stuff. But before I explain what I'm doing, we first need to do a couple of prerequisites. First, we need to go to our Discord settings and we need to scroll down to advanced. And when we're in advanced, we need to to go to the developer mode. You need to make sure this is enabled. If it's not, things don't work. Once you do that, you can close out of it. Then what we wanna do is we want to press F12 on our keyboard so that our console pops up. Now, inside of our console, we need to go to the network tab. But what you wanna do is you want to click on this little clear button so that it says recording network activity. Then what you wanna do is you want to type a message in Discord and send it. And when you open up your console again, you should see all of these things here. Now, what we want to do is we want to click on this fetch slash XHR button. And what it should leave us with is this messages field here. Now, we want to right click it, go to copy, copy as fetch. Then once you copy it, you want to go to your console and you want to paste in this whole entire thing. Now, there's something extremely important about all of this that I really need to point out. It's the fact that in this code here, you will see this authorization header. And this contains your whole entire Discord token. And what this token allows someone to do is log into your account. So make sure to do yourself a favor and uh, never send this code to anyone. And if you accidentally do leak your Discord token like I am right now, just change your password and things will be all hunky-dory, baby. But inside of this code, if we scroll down to the very bottom, this is the important bits here. But you will see that we have this little body field here and we have unknown content, nonce, and all this other weird stuff. And inside of content, this is the content of your message. You can see it's AKS, random letters, it's the same for my message. And then there's this nonce. And this nonce field here is very important. To magically edit our message, we are going to copy the message ID of the message we want to edit. And we're going to go back to our console, and we are going to replace this nonce here with the message ID, just by pasting it in. As you see, I'm going back and forth, so you can see I'm pasting this bad boy in. Now, inside of this content field, we are going to add our new edited message. So I just typed in new edited message, and now if I press enter on this, you will see that this changes to new edited message. Now, of course, there's a little bit of a bug. If you take a whole bunch of time, it will render as a completely new message. So that's why if you're going to do this bug, make sure to send a message, open up your console. You need to change the nonce to that new message ID, and when you press enter, kaboom, it changes to the new edited message. Maybe do some training runs before you try this in practice. So that's how this glitch works, but what can you do with it? Well, there's actually a lot of potential with this bad boy. For example, you're talking to one of your friends who's a little bit mentally unwell. For example, they're talking to themselves like a degenerate moron. Well, what you could do is you could uh, stealthily edit your messages and maybe convince them that there's cameras in your eyes. Take them out. Take out the cameras. Take out your eyes. Yeah, this would definitely push someone off the edge. Now, to be honest, sending goofy messages really isn't harmless, but things get so much worse. But before I get into what this thing can do, I want to figure out how it works with Discord. Because if Discord Discord doesn't show this as an edited message. What about server logs like Dino and client modifications like message loggers for Vencord? Do those show these messages as edited? Well, that's a good question and I think it's time to test. So right now I'm in the worst server on Discord, mine. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to send a message like normal, go back to my console, copy this bad boy as fetch, gonna go to my console, paste this bad boy in, and of course I forgot I need to copy the message ID as per usual. Then I'm gonna go back to my console, I am going to replace the nonce with the user ID or the message I it's it's just the ID of the message okay and I'm gonna change the content of course to there's cameras in your eyes take them out take out the cameras take out your eyes and kaboom the message is now rendered so let's see if this message was edited on my server so I'm gonna open up my account no text-to-speech down here and I'm in my message logs and uh, we can see that there's absolutely nothing I mean I could scroll up a little bit this guy here is a little down bad but if I keep scrolling up there's no message edit but what about message loggers in this case on my no text-to-speech account I have a message logger. As you can see, these messages are all red. Let's give it a shot. So I'm going to copy the ID of this message, open up my console as per usual. I'm going to change the nonce, paste it in. Let's see this live in action. I'm going to press enter. The message changes and the message logger doesn't see anything. So message logs in a Discord server doesn't show anything. Message loggers don't even show anything. Nothing shows up at all, which makes this extremely dangerous. Now, why is this little edited glitch 
glitch so dangerous? Well, there's two main reasons why that I can think of, and the first one is that scammers on Discord are like monkeys with typewriters. You know if you give a monkey a typewriter an infinite time, it could make Shakespeare? Well, Discord scammers with their 10 IQ, if you give them enough time, they're gonna find a 9,000 IQ strat to abuse this glitch to scam kiddos online. Society's doomed, boys. But there's also another really bad thing you could do with this, and it's called getting people banned on Discord servers, because what I did is I went on my Discord server, no text-to-speech, and I sent a message saying, hey, does anyone want free Nitro? And a little ace up my sleeve is that I actually changed the message to say, I am a minor. And if you are 20 plus and want to date me, just say yes. And after I press enter, I should see all these people rolling in messages that say yes, and now I get to ban every single one. Except there's a, there's a little bit of an issue here. You can see when someone replies to me, it shows the original message, which is just one of the shortcomings of this glitch. But that's not all, because remember when I sent this message saying that there's cameras in your eyes, take them out, take out the cameras? Well, if I just do the accidental whoopsies, I misclicked and refreshed the page, you will notice things change a little bit. In fact, there's two messages now. There's my original, I love you, and then there's cameras in your eyes, take them out, take out the cameras, take out your eyes. So what's actually going on here is that Discord is sending two messages, but if you don't refresh your client, it looks just like one. Wait, pause. Is this whole entire glitch pointless? Well, yes. If everyone knows to refresh their page, then nothing bad will happen. But to be honest, it's a little hard to know when to do that, so ideally this would be fixed. But I do want to point out a very hidden benefit behind this whole entire glitch that I actually really love. And it has to do with message loggers. Now let's say you accidentally send a message saying that your name is Dave. I'm sorry, Dave. And the person that you're talking to has a message logger. When you delete a message, it is going to get logged for them and they will know your information forever. But riddle me this, what if I just copy the message ID of the message, I open up my console, I paste in the ID for the nonce, and before I press enter, I delete the message. So now that I've deleted the message, if we look at the person with the message logger, it says that my name is Dave, my name is clear as day. Uh-oh, here comes the console again. If I press enter, it is going to hide the deleted message and it is going to send a new message, which completely removed my name from the message logger. Now, of course, you might be thinking, well, I could just, you know, go up, refresh the page and fix this, right? Well, when I refresh this page, if I'm using the Vencord message logger plugin, what will happen is that all those logged messages will be deleted. And in this case, even though I deleted my name, it technically still is deleted and then it gets undeleted, but then it gets fixed. So basically, boiling it down from my brain cloud of thoughts into words that actually make sense, this glitch can prevent your messages from being in a message logger, which is actually extremely cool. But the unfortunate thing is that this whole entire bug itself is a bug. It's a glitch on Discord, and chances are Discord will do something. Anywho, gamers, that's all I have regarding the secret edited message bug. But I do want to say that you might have noticed some of my video recording stuff was like following my mouse. Let me know if you like that versus the old stuff. I'm just experimenting with stuff, and I want some feedback, okay? I appreciate it a lot. You have a fantastic day, sweetheart. Mwah.